This is an easy GMAT problem solving practice question. It's a quantitative reasoning question from averages, statistics question. The average wages of a worker during a fortnight comprising 15 consecutive working days was 90 per day. 15 consecutive working days, essentially the average is $90 per day. During the first seven days, his average was $87 per day. During the last seven days, his average was $92 per day. What was his wage on the eighth day? Again, a question set to fit beautifully into the standard framework that we use for averages. Let's get started. All 15 days, number of days is 15. Average wages per day is equal to 90. So sum of wages for all of these 15 days is number times average, 15 times 90, which is equal to $1350. This is what he took home for all 15 days. First seven days, seven days. What is the average? Average is equal to 87. 7 into 87. 7 into 80, 560 plus 49. 560 plus 49 is 609. This is the sum of the wages for the first seven days. Sum of the average wages for the last seven days is equal to 92. 9 into 7, 63. 630 plus 14, 644 is what I have. So if I add these two, we have wages for 14 days. First seven, last seven. The eighth day alone is mixing, right? 14 days excluding 18, the eighth day will be a total of 14 days. Forget this thing. We'll look at the sum. This is 4, 9s are 13, 5, and this is 12. So sum of the wages for 14 out of these 15 days is $1,253. One day that's missing is the eighth day. If you add that, we should get the sum for all 15 days, right? So sum for 14 days plus wages of eighth day should give us sum for all 15 days. 1253 is the number that we had here. This is equal to a 1350 is equal to the wage for the eighth day. Wage for eighth day is 1350 minus 1253. 1350 minus 1250 is 100, 1253. So subtract a three from it. So that's going to make it as 97. So the wages on the eighth day is equal to $97. Choice D is the correct answer to this question.